Greetings and salutations, my fellow Entropians. We are on board the very egg. Yeah, it's it's been a, a quick little minute, but we're we're here. We're we're definitely back. Uh, I forgot how to do this. Um, there, there's buttons that need to be pressed. Oh, there we go. Oh, I guess that makes it pretty simple, huh? All right, we're gonna go over here to the hermit nesting grounds. I have I don't know, I don't know nothing about the hermits, but looks like there's a mothership gun turret now. What? Okay, I'll take it. We have just undocked for the Arcadia space station. So I'm so I'm so stoked. Um, let's see, automatically move. So we're we're definitely doing a space station. Leaving space, we're doing space stuff, okay? Uh, we just did a nice little, uh, what you call it? Keep moving, keep moving. It's okay to move. No, it is okay to move. Sorry. It's, it's been a long time. <laughs> it's been like a really, really long time. All right, there we go. Moving things around. Anyways. I'm pretty sure you guys already know, but, uh... When, when you sit there on a mothership, you, know, you gotta ask the mothership captain if you can come on board for one, and for two, you, you gotta ask if you if you can join the crew. Okay, and joining the crew is a very important thing. Uh, when you are a member of the crew, you can go around and repair the command center, the reactor, the hangar, and propulsion. You have no idea how long it took me to say propulsion correctly. I was practicing all day. But yeah, you can you, you can become the, a member of the crew, do all the other stuff, and then maybe, just maybe, if you're a good boy or a girl, the owner of the mothership might let you fly. Yeah, that's right. Some 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 crews they have different standards, such as you got to get. Uh, in, 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 in most cases, you have to get your vehicle structure engineer up to a certain level. In, in some ca some cases, it's like right right around level thirty. Uh, or 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 you could just bypass all that and just be like, here's a bunch of money. <laughs> either way works, for real. Either way works. Um, it it, it, it depends. It depends. But you also, you also gotta trust you. It. it a reputation in this game is, is always pretty important. Uh, where are we? We are still a little ways away. But, uh, it's... Oh, okay. Well, I guess it's this way. Pull, 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 I'm telling you, there's something over there. We're gonna go over here. Now, I don't know, maybe you could actually go around shooting these things. I might actually shoot a few shots, uh, but uh, mind you, I have, listen, listen, uh, it says 1,264 shots. Let me, let me just enlighten you as to how much ammo I have. 1,243. Okay. It's gonna... It, it, it's gonna take a lot. <laughs> like, a lot, a lot. But, uh, yeah. We'll, we'll cross that bridge when it comes com, comes to it. I'm, like, a little bit concerned. So, is this a little reticle? Am I gonna be able to shoot things? Am I gonna be able to, to do it like it used to be done? Where it just, like kite train all of all, all the mobs that have them hit me I, I don't even know I don't even know man that sound is so crazy cool um, I, I, I don't have access to any kind of warp capabilities I'm not really worried about that we're just gonna slowly go where no man has gone before while we Take, take a look. I have his sergeant access card. Oh my god, I really need to do stuff like that. The Oratan payback mission? Jeez. 
but I've been sitting there skilling. Um, I, I don't think I'm going to be able to get the scientist uh, with the vehicle structure engineer. I know this is going to sound kind of crazy. I think I could get the scientist through the animal loot profession before I get the, uh, the structure to get this one. Because I don't want to spend all, all that time, so I'm just probably just going to ultimately just chip in until, until I get there. It might not be a good idea, but it's the animal looter skill. Look, I don't I don't know if it really does anything. It just seems like it does, though. It really does. Like, I wouldn't say I'm profiting all the time, but I'm definitely, you know, I'm, I'm doing all right. It's just, I, I just keep throwing th stuff into the storage, is what it boils down to. And then I don't sell it, so then I feel poor. But in, act, in all actuality, I'm really not. I just haven't sold anything. Uh, sure, I could TT everything and become like, I don't know, a 20,000 air or something. It's really not what you should do. Try to get some markup, like maybe even just a little bit, which is, I'm probably going to. Um, what in the world? I keep on seeing stuff. seeing stuff. Is there really something behind me? What is that? Is that the thing I keep seeing? Am I going the right way? Which way am I going? You hear that? This is wild. This is absolutely wild. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and fast forward a little bit. We'll get there. I'm just talking and rambling as we see in a... I mean, the motherships are pretty slow. Let's, let's, just, let's, just, let's just be real. But, uh, yeah. Maybe I should do this. Actually head for it. Right. That makes more sense. Does that make sense to you? Where are we? Are we almost there yet? Shoot, we're almost there. Stay tuned. We're a little bit closer. Alright, so I actually promised a lot of people that I would actually explain Mind Force. Okay, so we're going to explain Mind Force until we start seeing some stuff. Listen. Alright, first things first. I don't have access to it, but inside the TT terminal, under medical, there is a mind something implant thing that looks like some tongs or something and you put it on your head and go <laughs> you only do that if you if you have stuff to put in it such as for example an empty skill implant or an actual skill implant <laughs> right you can actually put skill implants use that little tool but when you don't when you're just starting to get the mind force and stuff like that you need one of these. It's a, a Neoscion uh, Mind Force implant. I, notice I didn't say the number, because there's different numbers, okay? Uh, probably like the 10, or there's, I think there's even one in the TT, honestly. Um, but you have to get one of these, and you have to put it on top of the thing, like like merge it in, you know, how, 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 you, how you take one of, like, like one of these, and you drop it on top of, like, a, well, geez drop it on top of something yet yeah, like pretend like this is the little thing that you put the thing in and you take this and you drag it on top of this is where it turns green and, and you take this right here the neosyron implant put it on top of the thing that looks like tongs let's pretend these are the tongs and it'll turn green then you drop it in there then you equip this item and then you go and you put this on and you equip this Roger, are, 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 are we good? Are we good right now? Do you understand? And that will allow you to equip chips. All you gotta do is equip. Just like you would any other weapon. And how it basically works is this thing is going to decay along with the chip when you're sitting there attacking things. And if you put an amp on it, it will also decay over time. And, but you'll be able to use mine. 
You'll be able to use the regeneration chips, it, anything. However, however, if the chip is too high for your mind force implant, you won't be able to equip it. So there you go. There's that. You, you have that. So that that's pretty much how you how to do the mind force. Okay. Now, look. I I understand that some some of you already know some of this information. Some of you actually do not. But uh, if, if you're actually here, listen, this is your mind force right here, okay? You got the biotropic, you got the jammer, you got your sweat gatherer, you got your telepath, you got your translocator. Okay, biotropics is healing, okay? Uh, jammer is basically when you get hit with mind force, probably in PvP or if some mob actually has mind force, I don't know. Uh, it's like evade and dodge, except for it's mind force related. Sweat gatherer, we you should probably already know that what that is. Telepath is for like synchronizations, like using a synchronization chip or something like that. Translocator is teleporting. Now they moved all of the combat-based professions for mind force over to the actual combat tree. So you'll have cryogenic, cryogenic, uh, py pyro, uh, electro, kinetic, which is electric. Boogie, woogie, 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 right? And uh, there, there might be another one. Uh, well, probably not, actually. Um, electrokinetic hit and damage, both hit and damage. So you have to, you know, be within the skill increase bonus of whatever. And uh, where the hell are these mobs, bro? I bet you they're over there. I bet you they're over here. I bet. I bet you. I bet you. I bet you they're over here, like right in the rocks. I I have not actually been out through here. Like for real, I have not. Like I remember the old the old place where it was like right around the corner. Like right here, but I guess they moved it over here, so it, it takes a little longer to to do the thing. So I don't know. Anyways, do you understand the mind force? Okay, it's not that hard, but uh, getting, getting used to it. You know, you, you gotta you gotta do the same thing that you've done with like weapons in the uh, SIB. But if you can't use it. Big example. We got a big example here. If you are not allowed to actually use it, where the hell did I put? I, I, I had a bigger chip that I'm just not allowed to use. Okay. If you're not allowed to use it, you won't be able to equip it at all. I think. Probably. It, it won't do anything. It's, I think it's impossible. But if you are, there you go. You'll be able to. Start small, work your way up, get your skills. Um, pros and cons of Mind Force usage? Well, uh, I really think it is actually a little bit less decay. Really. It's like a little bit less decay than like, you know, using like a, a rifle or something like that. Now, individual experiences may, 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 may vary or differ or, you know, it, it's probably going to be different. Where are we going? Going to the rocks. Going to the rocks. It's so eerie and, and, and there's no, there's not supposed to be any sound in space. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. All right. Oh snap! It looks like it is time. It is go time, buddy. It's go time. Am I gonna be able to? I don't know. I don't know. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's go. Oh, you best bet. 
You best believe it. Oh, kid. Oh, wait. I, wait, no. Come back. Come back. I want to loot you. Let me loot you. I want to loot you. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here, you. Come here. Let me loot you. I want to loot you. How do I loot? How am I supposed to loot if I can't get to it? Come on. Oh, it's because I guess I'm, I'm too far away, too close. That not far enough. What is going on? How do I loot this damn thing? Where where is it? The gun. Where's the gun? I get. I guess. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. What? Am I just dumb or something? Why am I dumb? I don't want to be dumb. Well, that sucks. Whatever. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, there's a lot of gunner seats. There's a there's a lot of gunner seats. The co-pilot. Do I have to be the co in the co-pilot chair or something to loot? I don't know. What is all this? I'm not in a team. I don't know what's going on. Tell me what I'm doing wrong. I'm so embarrassed. I just want my loot. I just want my loot. It's not gonna let me loot. I want my loot. Sophie, go get it. Go get my loot. Just, just go get it. <laughs> you know what? Screw it. We don't need loot. Wait, we might have already actually got loot. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Here we go. Come here. Come here. Come here. Get down a little bit. Ah, oh, you evasive little bastard. A little bit further. Okay, I almost get it. Come here. Like really upsetty spaghetti, but man, that's that's crazy skills right there. I, gu I guess it's different if you if you get, do, like. Do I have to like get out? Like, is it, like literally, like get out, and fly, and loot it? it? Seems like it. Loot, loot! Damn you! Whatever. I don't even care. I got skills. That's all that matters. Anyways. Another way you can do it is just get hit. A lot. If anybody knows how to do these things, let me know. <laughs> but see, actually... You know, when you get hit, you're basically just, uh, I don't know, getting a lot of skills, just, just 
just like that. A whole mess load ton of skills. Sorry I couldn't actually sit there and shoot at the damn things and then expect to loot it in a mothership for some reason. That's weird. I don't know. Maybe something's broken. Very frustrating. These things are very noisy and annoying. But, here's the thing. When you're flying in the mothership, that's right. You're, flying, you're gonna fly in a mothership one of these days. Don't, don't, don't pretend that you, you'll never fly a mothership. It doesn't have to be yours. You just have to have permission. It's very important to get permission. I don't think I asked to take this out though. So if I if I if I'm in any trouble for doing this, you you'll let me know. Um, we are definitely we have de definitely taken out the very egg, and uh, we we are, we are we are getting the very egg beat, beat up. Now now just mind you, I did repair it fully before before we started. You know, because you got to repair it. But look at all the skills. Spacecraft avoidance skills right there. Look at all the good skills. It's good skill. And avoidance can actually go into some of your evade skills as well. But you get your spacecraft system skill up and then you just, just do a skip sailing from there. I don't know if I have permission to shoot. Don't worry, Yoshi. I will pay you back. I will give you money if you need it. I, I have money. I have. I definitely have some money. So I'm just gonna shoot some, some of these things. Come here. Dude. I get these spacecraft weaponry skills. Oh yeah. Get some get some positive karma for the for the variant. Yeah. Maybe maybe be able to fight. Wait a minute. I seen something. Something's not right. Something's not right. Something's not right. Skills. Still trying to loot, by the way. They're all behind me. Oh, I guess I was shooting the entire time. Look at me. Stop. Stop shooting it. All right. Hopefully, I didn't burn so much body. Holy crap! Uh, oh, another thing you have to look out for. Listen, I I haven't done this in such a long time, and it, it, it's kind of absolutely different from what I, I'm used to. It used to be a little bit different, but it's about the same. Um, you kind of got to look out for what, what's going on right here, right? Like, I think it used to be you could just like pull it back in the dock whenever whenever it's like low. But now I think I think the status quo is to just go ahead and get it blown blown up. As long as you're getting all these skills and you just keep tanking these things. I'm like really upset that I can't do it. Maybe we need to like actually go out there and pick it up ourselves. I don't know. Maybe, just maybe, we might actually end up, like, uh, I don't know, getting uh, some sort of Hall of Fame later, you know? We can just 
barreling through all these things. It's good skilling. I'm telling you, it's good skilling. Hey, there's the Arcadia Moon. I own I own some of that. This is pretty exciting stuff. Oh crap. You know what? I just I just thought of something. Oh man. I forgot all about it. Oh yeah, we're doing a video. My bad. Anyways, Mind Force, I hope that helped. Uh I hope you know how to loot in space. I do not. Apparently. Uh, apparently I kinda dumb. So who knows? Maybe, maybe it's to shoot other other ships. You know? Screw screw mobs. Shoot other ships. I, I would I wouldn't do that though. Uh I'm not like that. At least not in this game. If this was this if this was Fallout though. Best bet. I'm about to. I'm about to take. This. I'm about to take some stuff. No, this is. This is. Dang. Absolutely insane. It's getting hammered right now. But the whole goal is to get hammered. You know, you don't sit there and drink alcohol or anything like that. Right it or wrong. So, I guess if I don't have any loot on me, I guess, I guess it, it won't drop if I die anyway. So, I guess we have that going on for us. Man, look at all that avoidance skill that we're getting. Definitely get some good skills here. Spacecraft piloting. Um, I think these freaking frick things are really loud. Anyways, this is happening right here. Yeah, right here. There's like 42.39 and a 16, level 16, I'm competent. Clearly, I, it says I'm competent, but I clearly am not competent. I can't even loot these damn things. Listen, laugh all you want. This is a comedy show. Co comedy and information. She's so noisy. So noisy. Be like, you know, if you want to loot, you know, probably be in a team or something. They might still in my team. I don't know. Probably not. We've been doing so many team things lately. Maybe I just have to re log. I don't even know. But yeah, uh, we're, we're still skilling. I, I think I, I think we're gonna we're gonna fly this thing until the wheels fall off. And if there's any like decay damage or anything like that, I would definitely pay for it. Yeah, mostly because it's on video. I I totally took took the the very egg out for a joyride and just getting all sorts of just skills, including gunnery skills. So. Let, just let Yoshi know, you know, like, let her know that, uh, I might owe her money. <laughs> Did you see Lars Bates' recent video? He said he took the beat fairy egg out for a joyride. Like, yes, yes I did. And he got it beat up. Yeah, yeah, yeah I did. <laughs> and it blew up in the middle of space. Yep, that happened. Why isn't it damaged? Because I'm going to repair it before I leave. <laughs> but man, yeah, this is, this, is, this is how it's done. Um, the only thing is, is if you let them hit you for too long, um, they, you stop getting skills from them, 
and uh, you gotta you gotta be wary of that. Um, it's just the nature of the beat. I mean, look, you're getting like a lot of the skills, and I mean, you're not gonna do everything all in one run. It's gonna take you multiple runs. But uh, whenever you uh, damage damage the whole the whole ship, what ends up happening is somebody can come along and they can start repairing it again, and then rinse and repeat. Um, it does seem kind of a little bit counterproductive, but uh, people are really after those repair, vehicle repair skills, mostly because these, these little bastards are really noisy, and I know you're a little bit annoyed by it, but that's okay. When have I ever cared about you being annoyed at something, you know? Never. Oh, jeez. Alright, it looks like the hangar's about to go. Propulsion is... is, is Really taking a lot of a lot of flack right now. Um, oh yeah, that's the reactor right here. Uh, it's not a good situation to be in, um, honestly. But uh, it is kind of the point. So here here we are, try, trying trying our best to do the thing. Oh yeah, that's the command center. We're about to go. Uh, down with the down with the ship. Um, no, I, I'm completely okay with this. Computer skills, spacecraft pilot skills, avoidance skills, all the skills. We're getting all the skills, and then we're gonna get even more vehicle repair skills. And we even got some gunnery skills. We're just gonna need the mob, rip, whatever. It is what it is. But uh. You know, I don't know what the schedule is for the very or anything like that uh, coming in, but uh, Yoshi's pretty cool, so uh, she usually uh, hangs out on uh, Arcadia. Uh, you'll probably see her over at the Celeste Quarry. Um, she has multiple shops in the Celeste Quarry and in the Arcadia Underground. She's kind of like royalty, guys. So if you see her, treat her with respect and. Uh, might be able to do on the very next. Yeah. Did you catch any of that? I have been removed from the top gunner seat. Um I got I got bad news for you. Sorry Yoshi. My bad. That is, that is quite the sight to see, though. It, it is the destruction of an entire mothership right there. And the destruction of me. But I'm still here. Like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell icon. I'm definitely, seriously, I'm... I'm doing entropia content. Yeah. I hope you learned something. Or at least laughed a little. <laughs> I blew up a mothership. <laughs> yeah. Bye. I'm repairing the very egg now. I, apparently I got in trouble.